In this problem, I can again solve using either substitution or elimination, whichever one I prefer. Now since both of my equations, the first equation and the second equation, are equal to y, what I'm going to do is set the right hands of the equations equal to each other. So I'm substituting 8x plus 1 in for the y over here. So then my goal is to solve to get x by itself. So I want to get all of the x's to the same side of the equal sign. So I'm subtracting 6x from both sides. So I get 2x plus 1 is equal to 3. Then I'm going to subtract the 1 so that I just have the x term alone. So I have 2x is equal to 2. And if I divide by 2, I get that x is equal to 1. So immediately, I can eliminate two of my solutions. Now what I'll do is I'll go through and substitute this x value in on one of my two equations. It doesn't matter which one I choose. In this case, I'm going to choose the second one just to be a little wild. So where the x is, I replace it with a 1. 6 times 1 is 6. And then 6 times 3 is 9. So my solution is the ordered pair 1, 9.